Reading is fun. Reading is fun because there are different kinds of books. Different books for different kinds of fun. Do you like just the facts, please? Do you like information books? Maybe favorite sports, games, hobbies, world records, different places, arts, music, cooking, animals, history, or the life of famous people. If you like reading books about real people, places, and things, then you like nonfiction books. Do you like to use your imagination? Do you like to wonder what if? Great authors create great stories that entertain us. When an author creates a story, we call that fiction. But you know, fiction can be based on true things too. In fact, if you want to see what it would be like to live through history or see exotic places through another person's eyes, then you want a fiction book. A fiction book that is based on real people, places, or events. Yep, lots of different kinds of books for different readers. Lots of different books for when we're in different moods, too. Most of us change over time. We like to meet different people, do different things, and read different types of books, too. Times change, people change, our reading interests change. As you can see, there are many different types of fun books for different readers. Different fun books for the same readers, too, when we are in different moods. Yep, books are pretty cool, aren't they? Thinking about different genres makes it easy to find fun books, too. We can cover most fiction books by thinking about six types of books, six fiction genres. There's realistic fiction, and humor, and adventure, then fantasy, and science fiction, historical fiction, and literature. Let's keep this simple. We don't have to make this a big production. If you like literature or are interested in writing, then you might want to also look at the ways authors create stories within each of these six genres. We'll just look at the basic differences in different types of stories, things to think about when selecting books to read. Let's start with realistic fiction, sometimes also called problem novels. Realistic fiction attempts to illustrate situations that we might face in today's world. Often, these books feature things that teenagers experience as they move into adulthood. Another popular type of writing is humor. Don't we all like to laugh? Even the most serious story can contain humor. We can find humor in practically every situation. It can be an effective tool to deal with problems. Writers of any genre can use humor to develop situations and characters, though some books are funny, good reads, humor books. Looking for some excitement? Then adventure, sports, mysteries, supernatural, and horror stories might be your thing. These types of stories are all related. They are about getting away. Adventure, sports, and mystery are all thought of as pleasure reading and escape literature. For example, sports can be a metaphor for the game of life. These forms of literature take us out of our normal day-to-day -day existence and put us in extraordinary circumstances. Maybe you want something more than exciting. You want to challenge your imagination. Then you will want to read fantasy and science fiction. Do you like to see an author create an exciting world unlike anything anyone has seen? Fantasy writers get to make up all the rules. Perhaps you prefer to stretch your imagination within the world as it could be. Science fiction stays within reasonable boundaries. A precise definition of these two books is difficult because these genres are related. We can look at these two genres together. They are fun, imaginative books. If you like to read information books, then you will want to look for historical fiction. These books are based on real people, places, and events. Historical fiction presents the past in a manner that connects us on a personal and emotional level. 
By nature, these books get readers involved with history in exciting and interesting ways. These characters, although not all real historical figures, always behave appropriately for the historical setting. Another kind of fiction is literature. Things like poetry, drama, and short stories. Perhaps due to the popularity of spoken word, rap, and hip-hop, poetry books are very popular. Short stories are also hot now. These stories can be highly entertaining while representing a more manageable read than a novel. For busy readers, short stories have a lot to offer, but remember, these types of books are probably in your library's Dewey Decimal Collection, the nonfiction stacks. They are often classified as literature and shelved in the 800s. Yeah, they're fiction, but they are usually assigned Dewey numbers because this keeps the different type of literature together on the shelves. It makes it easier to browse. You know, look over the shelves, for fun books that catch your eye. Looking for some ideas for fun books? Most librarians have book lists to help you and librarians can give you suggestions too. You can also search library catalogs or the web for ideas. Club TNT, Today Not Tomorrow, a TV show on My Madison TV 14 has an online book club. I put it together to share some of the popular books that teens are reading. You can check it out at www.clubtnt.org. That's www.clubtnt.org. There are many resources there. We are always looking to add more. Please visit us online and be sure to scroll down our web and look for the link to our TNT Book Club. We identify some of today's popular authors. You will find many suggestions. Books that are popular in Madison, they are probably popular in your town or school too. And if we forgot your favorite book, let us know. Send us an email. Send it to webmaster at clubtnt.org. Be sure to give us the complete title and the author. It also helps if you tell us what genre you would classify the book as. Looking for a fun book? Please check out our online book club. Want to share a fun book? Let us know what you're reading. Yep, there are many different books for different readers. There are many different books for the same reader. Different genres. Check them out. It's fun to try new things. It's fun to share different types of books. 